Hi guys, Sarah here from Organic Fusions and in this video I wanted to give you an example of the icebreaker which I have chosen for the event that you are attending uh, very soon. For this particular event I would like you to, pre to prepare two truths and one lie. So the way that that works is that between now and when you come to the event try and think of three stories. Two of them need to be real stories that have happened in your life and one of them can be a lie. Now some very clever people have previously come to events and they've told their lie, which sounded like such an amazing story that it must be true, like who could make something up like that? And that is because they told a, a truth which was not their own truth, truthful story, but the truthful story of someone else. So that way you get all the details and you're, you're very convinced that it's a real story, but actually that's a lie. So that's a good way of tricking people. Uh, another thing that you can do, which I do sometimes and it throws people out, is that you can tell a truthful story about yourself, but just change one little aspect of it to turn it into a lie. So for example, if I was to tell you two truths and a lie about myself, and these are ones that I have shared at previous events, then I might say, number one, I ate a tarantula in Vietnam. Number two, I went to visit Santa Claus in Lapland in uh, Finland. And number three, I'm missing six teeth. So I would tell those stories to the people in my group and usually we're, if it's a dinner, we're sitting in groups of about six. Uh, so I would share those stories with the people around me and then everyone gets a chance to ask me some questions maybe to try and get a little bit more information. Uh, and eventually they will suggest which one they think is a lie and after everyone's had a guess, then I will let them know that, well, actually, I am missing six teeth, so I've had my wisdom teeth out, and before I had braces, I had these two teeth at the front taken out. Uh, I have also gone to visit Santa Claus in Finland. That was back in 2008. And uh, the first one was that I, I did eat a tarantula, but it was in Cambodia, it wasn't in Vietnam. So that's actually a lie, but I used a story that's semi-true for myself, just change, changing one aspect of it. And by sharing those stories, that also helps for further conversation. So then people might ask me questions about how was Santa Claus or how was Finland? Or uh, they might ask me about my travels to Vietnam or what does a tarantula chase, taste like? Or what was the third one? Um, or how long did I have my braces on for? That's not a very exciting conversation to have, but uh, the two truths and a lie that you share with people will help to start other conversations uh, at the event. So try to be creative with your stories. Some people come along and they don't prepare anything at all and then they end up saying something very simple like I have a dog, I have a cat and I have a fish, which doesn't really help the other people who are meeting you to uh, progress with the conversation. So to make it easier on everyone when you come out to an event, do your homework, prepare some creative two truths and a lie, and we will see you at the event soon. Cheers, hope this video helps, bye.